but I have problems. And I think every woman is beautiful, but I meet the crazy ones. I was dating a girl three weeks. She rolls over in bed and goes, hey, if we were to have a kid, that's not the crazy part. <laughs> if we were to have a kid, and that kid committed a murder, would you turn him in or cover it up? She says, my friends agree with me. They would cover it up. She starts texting her friends, would you cover up a murder? Her friends are writing back, yeah, cover up a murder. Yeah, cover up a murder. Hashtag murder! <laughs> well, man, your friends are crazy, too. Yeah. Very funny Michael Yo, correspondent on the CBS TV entertainment news show, The Insider. Yes. That is not appropriate uh, bedtime conversation. No, well, I meet crazy girls. But now I'm married, so it's all good. That's it's that, all fine. That's in the past, so I can talk about all these. Actually, that girl came to one of my shows, and after I did that joke, she stood up stood up and went, that's me, that's me. <laughs> yeah, she wants to take some credit she, yeah, for and everybody like, material. You're crazy. Yeah, you're that's crazy. not crazy. Yeah. That's a different level of crazy. Uh, Michael, you're in town because you have performed is tonight, two yes. shows tonight and two shows Saturday night. That's right. right. At uh, Rick Bronson's House of Comedy over at Mall of America. Uh, you're, uh, you know, you do TV work. Yep. I know you're on the radio with a, a good friend of ours. Tony from, Fly. Tony Fly. That's right. We Legendary started. Twin Cities DJ. Yeah. We just moved to L.A. Just moved to L.A. Uh, he's part of my show. We're going to start it on Sirius XM. It's going to be called the Michael Yo and Tony Fly Show. So I'm so excited about that. It's going to be heard nationwide on Hits 1. So we're rocking. You're going to love, love Tony. He oh, is awesome. I love Tony. I, I, know, is... I, I worked with him in Austin like, oh, cool. oh, wow. like 20 years Very ago. Good. I'm old. You, you've That's done <laughs> so much in your career. Well, Seriously, thank you, Kim. You're the, you do the stand up stuff. Uh -huh. We know that you're an entertainment reporter. Mm -hmm. Do you have any like celebrity scoop gossip for us this yeah, morning I, I, that you can break right here on WCC? I don't have any celebrity scoop I can break, mm -hmm. but I will be at the Golden Globes this cool. Sunday with all the fancy stars, and you can sure. see that on CBS. Uh, we'll be there. But, you know, I was just with Mark uh, Wahlberg for Patriots Day and Amy Adams. Uh, so, you know, I interviewed them about the award season, and uh, they're all getting ready. It's going to be craziness. It's going to be craziness. Now, when you do your uh, show... I talk about celebrities. A lot of oh, celebrity lot. I, I have celebrity stories. I talk about my life. I'm putting together, actually, um, my hour special right now. So you're going to see a bunch of new material. You're going to see slideshows. I talk a lot about growing up. Asian dad, I mean, Asian mom, black dad. So it's a lot about race. It's a lot, but it's family friendly. Everything is family friendly. All right, well, I have to ask you, what's yes. your take on Mariah? Was she sabotaged? I think she's crazy. Okay. <laughs> I, think, I think Mariah, I've, met, I've interviewed her several times. She's right. a diva. Uh -huh. She is exactly, but she owns Well, it. of course uh -huh. she's a diva. She's so a diva. what? Yeah. Yeah. That's, the, that's the production company's but, fault but, for not realizing. No, it. but why she's are you going to, why, why do you say I want to do uh, a reality TV show? when they're looking for drama. Yeah. Nobody, you know what yeah. I mean? So it's going to make her look crazy. She can mm. sing. Everybody knows she can sing. The whole debacle. But I believe it was for TV. Mm. I believe it was for that show. Hey, that's got a lot of people talking about it for a long time. That's And that's what it's about, people. Yep. That's, that's it. it. That's, that's it. it. That's what it's about. And I want to give a special, uh, go to michaelyo.com okay. slash hookup. And I, I'm going to give away some tickets. So michaelyo.com cool. slash hookup. And so people can come to the show tonight. Very good. You're yeah. ready. You're I'm ready very, to rock. I'm very excited. What do you think about this weather? This is your first time in Minnesota. I think it's really cold. Like yeah. very That's like negative. I've never yeah. been in negative nine degree weather. I don't. Even, my body doesn't even know how to react. Right. We got now. a heat wave coming though. Yeah, I heard uh, Kylie saying it's a heat wave coming through. It's Double gonna digits. be. It's gonna be five degrees, <laughs> and then it's gonna be ten. I'm like, really? Yeah. Really? That's, That's a heat wave. We gotta grab hope where we can. Yeah. I got. There's you. this movement here in Minnesota. People want to celebrate. The cold. Celebrate. North. The Cele North. Well, you have a lot of celebrating then because y'all yes. must celebrate like eight months out of the year. I mean, it's a big celebration. Now it's don't go back to LA and tell everyone that it's always negative nine because it's not. Well, oh, sometimes, sometimes it's five. Yes. Sometimes, sometimes it's five. Well, yeah, is that the hottest it gets? It's like 22 degrees over here. Yeah, the summers it's like 90 though. Oh, so really? I mean, yeah, it has the. I heard it's a beautiful city, but since I'm at Mall of America, that's. All I will see right. is your mall audience. You know what? And Mall of America. How does that How does your mall audience represent 
uh, the, the city. The mall is uh, the very mall, nice yes. now. The mall is a wonderful place that. to be this time of I year. I said, how do the people <laughs> at your mall represent your city? It's good people watching. Okay. Okay. You get tourists from all over the world. Yes, you do. Oh, it's uh, other people. It's other people. It's other people. It's other people. Uh -huh. <laughs> Only the best looking people are going to go to Michael's show that, tonight that at Rick Bronson's House of Comedy. Tonight, 7.30, 9.45. Again, two shows tomorrow night. 22 bucks for the tickets. Do you like that? I mean, I'm not, I'm not here to make anybody mad. Well, I'm morning. just saying, man. I I, I probably did really bad today on your show after watching your yoga segment. It's because, a tough act to follow. I mean, the whole, yeah. It's a tough act. Yeah. When yeah. you're trying to bring comedy in already, <laughs> I mean, two minutes on. of a 41 year old man doing yoga. Uh, uh, I know. Just I'm you, sore. You, the you know lady what? kept use saying. That, use that core material. Just do the happy baby on oh, stage. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yes, really you'll good. always get a laugh. All right, happy thanks, baby. Thanks, Michael. Thank you. Thank you.